us getting ready to go to the park. But before I go outside, first I have to put my shoes on and tie them. Do you know how to tie your shoes? Well, why don't we do it together? So first I got my right foot, put that shoe on there, pull those laces tight. There we go. Now I'm gonna put the other one on. I like to put both of my shoes on first before I tie them. Now I wanna kind of pull a little bit here from the top just to make sure I get it nice and tight. Then when I'm all done with that, I'm going to make a small little knot from under, right? You're probably really good at doing that part already because most students are really good at doing that part of their shoe tying process. Now where it gets a little bit more tricky is now that I'm here, what do I do with these two laces? Well, I'm just gonna go ahead and drop one down. I'm gonna take one and make it like a little loop-de-doop, just like that. So I have one little loop. Then I'm gonna take my other lace and I'm gonna wrap it around that loop-de-doop and find the little teeny tiny opening here where I can pull it through and make it just like that. <gasps> Let's try it on the other foot. So I pulled my laces nice and tight to make sure that my foot is in there really, really good. Here's the first part of our process where we make one tie just like so and pull it. Now here comes the part where I'm going to make a loop. So I'm going to use my finger to help me as I loop it and gather it at the bottom. I'm going to swoop with the other side and then I'm going to pull it through that little tiny opening so we have a loop swoop and pull and I'm just about ready to go although if you want to be a little extra and make sure your foot really stays in your shoe and that you're not tripping all over your shoelaces I would recommend a double knot so what we're going to do there is I'm going to take my two little loops they kind of look like little bunny ears don't they and I'm going to tie those just around each other. I'm going to cross them over and put one through the hole. Now I am double knotted and there's no way that my shoe is going anywhere and no way that I'm tripping over these laces. Let me do it now on the other shoe. So I have my two little funny rabbit ears. I'm going to pretend that they're just, you know, not looped, but just one lace. I'm going to crisscross them put one of those little bunny ears through the little hole, the little bunny hole, if you will, and pull it together and voila. Well, now that I'm double knotted, we're all ready to go to the park. <laughs> Let's go.